Here is where local Thai workers are processing natural rubber. Rubber, as a high-yield agricultural product, is very common in Thailand. So let's take a look at how rubber is made and what the returns might be like. Rubber initially takes the form of a liquid. After it is collected, a certain amount of acidic additives are added to make it solidify without damaging the molecular structure of the rubber. The rubber is then poured into containers and left to solidify, or it can be placed in large tanks separated by partitions. The solidified rubber blocks will contain a lot of air bubbles and moisture, which need to be pressed in machines to make them smooth and aesthetically pleasing. During the drying process, the rubber gradually turns yellow due to oxidation. When the rubber is completely dried, locals call them rubber sheets, which are the main raw materials for making tires, shoe soles, and other automotive components.